Hi there people, we have a problem. I'm on my way to the shop and I've just noticed these council workers up here cutting the grass. Machines are smoking. It's a wet Friday morning. Don't know why they're cutting grass in the rain, but that's Falkirk Council for you, wasting taxpayers' money by carrying out silly acts like this. You look at all the misery all over. How is people meant to actually got them down there with buggies, electric scooters, anything like that? Because they'll not tidy that mess up. Look at that garden, that's sitting in smoke, man. See, it's getting worse, look at that. See, just before I put the video on, the actual machines were fucking smoking. Sorry for the swearing, but... Wow, I've had a long night. Um, Kirsty was, as I say, Kirsty was up at the hospital. Um, to get some treatment for a, a wound um, that she had an operation on and it didn't get it didn't heal up properly so um, she was in pain so she had to go up so they sent her home with antibiotics and more painkillers the usual but she says that they need department of fault that was thriving you know what I mean there was at least four police police vans and cars and two jeeps and there was a young lass at 13 um, got brought in with social services and wow man fire's getting a bit high is it no um, yeah um, she brought in the social work services and she ran out the building and they'll say they had to phone the police to go and get her so obviously she's, all, she's okay and she's found and she's well obviously she had mental health issues because um, it was her key worker or something but apparently the place was actually Busy last night at Falkirk Royal. Um, I'm just looking at this smoke man. Look at that. Man. Now that was one of their machines, man. Eh? Cause see when I walked in the corner before the video, the guy was just come. The guy was just going in there, and he, this machine was smoking. And he just went into the back, in the back fence. And now look, and I think his machine's went on fire. It's a great day, a Friday, huh? A great day, a Friday. A great start to a Friday. Right? And the weekend. He's in trouble for his bosses, you know. But anyway. Aye. So, that's how I've not been on. Just look at the day. You know what I mean? It's just... Miserable. Muggy. Clammy. But yet... We've got a... Fire. For somebody's dark garden created by one of the council machines. Look at him in a machine. He's not even interested. He's just following that about. That's what we pay for. We pay for money for people to go about. <laughs> no, I'm mentally. Eh? That's sad. Hopefully I get it sorted. But I um, up at the up at the the folk at E last night. Yeah, there were quite a lot of people who get brought in from prison, the prison vans and um, police stations, and they were all kind of following other place and that. But Kirsty wasn't want to um, film it because she was up there with her dad and you know what I mean, as I say, but apparently I a young lassie and now in my perspective she'd been in care, you know what I mean? Um she was brought in by her social workers and that and she didn't want to be there, she'd want to kill herself and all that kind of stuff and that eh. Um so that just shows you what's going on with the younger generation now, you know what I mean? that they're going into these places and they've not got the right way of treating them in or looking after them. Their answer is just take them at a shop. But I'll catch up with you later on, eh? See you later on, pal. Right, bye-bye.